Well, the sisters of a woman who was killed in a hit and run crash finally have some answers tonight. The man accused of killing her, he's finally been caught. We told you a month ago about this search for the suspect after that October crash at Kirby Parkway in 385. Fox 13 Sierra Jordan joins us from East Memphis tonight. Sierra, you spoke with the victim's sisters. What did they have to say? They told me they were happy. They are finally getting justice for their baby sister. Now, they were in the process of sending money to Crime Stoppers to help find the suspect. But they found out today the police have a man in custody and is facing several charges. I have an arrest especially before Christmas. That'll be a, as good a present for us. <laughs> it's been 38 days since the death of Sarah Hamer. Hamer was killed in a crash on Kirby Parkway and Highway 365 just after she got off work in late October. Sarah's gone, you know. She's gone. She's not coming back. The U.S. Marshals in Memphis arrested 37-year-old DeAndrea Clark for allegedly killing Hamer. Investigators say Clark crashed into Hamer's car while doing 85 in a 40-mile-per-hour zone. Police say he left the scene and Hamer later died in the hospital. The Two Rivers Task Force and the Shelby County Fugitive Apprehension Team went to the 3800 block of Weave Meadows Lane to find Clark Monday. He now faces charges of vehicular homicide, leaving the scene of an accident involving death, driving on a suspended license, and more. I'm kind of speechless because I didn't figure it would be much over the vehicular homicide, but I am glad for those charges, and I hope he's found guilty on every single one of them. Fox 13 told you before the three sisters would wake up every morning and talk on the phone before going to work. Sandra and Evelyn Richardson say they still have those conversations with each other, but it's not the same. They say this year would be the first Christmas without their baby sister. We just got to take it day by day, day by day, day by day, some days. I can look at her picture and smile and look at her videos and smile. Now, DeAndrea Clark had a bail hearing today. The judge has set his bond at $50,000. He is scheduled to be back in court tomorrow at 9 a.m. Darcy. That is Fox 13 Sierra Jordan reporting live from East Memphis tonight.